What's up everyone, my name's Nagark, and it has been a day since I last played. And I never got past this thing. But I have been working on a concept. And I'm hoping it's gonna work, because I believe I finally figured out catapults. Now I'm just gonna start with sort of what I had going last time, sort of a base. I need something to put my catapult on. And I learned that sometimes you need a lot of braces. And by a lot of braces, I mean a lot of braces, right? Yeah. And I want this catapult to be huge. Now, I'm, I'm still working on some of it. Like, I haven't mastered the catapult quite yet. Uh, so this may still be going a little bit slow going, but this thing needs some wheels. So that I can go, I need to get a little bit closer to that thing. Alright, now, I need a thing, right, I need a catapult. And I want it to go all the way back here. That is my goal, is to have the catapult go all the way back so it can it can fling. I don't want it to just land on itself. If you've seen my prototype videos, you've seen I've made I've made things that just bomb themselves. That's not what I want. So, how am I going to do this? Can I make this any higher? Yes. Okay. Now I know that I at one point had like It wasn't a steering hinge, it was just like a normal hinge. I think I did something along these lines? Maybe. And then I delete... Like, what happens if I play this? Okay, that, that works pretty well. That's looking like a catapult. Kind of. There is an issue where I can't actually put the holder on here. So this might be just one too tall. So let's put a hinge on it. Put a wooden block on it. Bring it all the way back. Because this is how physics works. And then put a holder on it. Intersection. Is it because it's too far back? Is that what's blocking me? Yes. Okay. And then put a bomb in it. Now, is this going to fall out? Yes. So what I want is maybe like a little block right there? No. Okay. <laughs> Bear with me. Shit! That's too much? Oh, crap. Uh, I had to actually test if this was too high, or if I'm just stupid. It, it could very well be both. Yeah, it was both. Yep. Does that really surprise anyone here? Hmm. Hmm. Okay, so it does have to be one less. It can't be that tall. There we go. Maybe I can do this. Maybe it can be half. Maybe it can be half like that. Let's check it out. Oh, yeah, I could do that. Why am I making it so... so crazy? Why shit so crazy? Can it go in? Ah. Oh. We're getting close. We are getting close. Bear with me. Okay. You might be saying, how is that going to launch? Contractable springs. Right? Is that what they are? I think that's what they are. So you drag, get up underneath it. You 
drag and get... It's a little finicky sometimes. I believe that's right. Are they both? Okay, and the launching thing for this is L. So I don't expect this to hit it, but this is what it's going to do. Try that again. Okay. This is what I was saying, that braces are very necessary. Because right now, it's just collapsing on itself. So, I need to brace this thing, like, down. And just brace it so that it won't come flying apart at the mere thought of this thing launching. I'm trying to make it symmetrical. Okay, so that one... God, what am I doing? I've made a mess. But it might be a, a launching mess. Let's see. Oh, so close! Let's try that one more time. Okay. Sometimes it's a little finicky. If you, It's actually different if you hold L, and if you, like, tap L. Alright, I'm gonna let it settle, then I'm gonna hold L, yeah. I'm gonna let it settle, I'm gonna tap L. So, holding L is the way to go here. Yes, holding L is the way to go. And it might just be a case of moving this forward. Alright, are we lined up? Alright, let it settle. Oh yeah, that thing is. Did I... Oh wait, I, I, for whatever reason, as my thing is exploding, I'm like, did it launch? Did it go right? Oh shit, it went way over. This is just a matter of figuring out where it's gonna hit, guys. Fuck. Settle. Man! Like I said, it's very finicky. Like, sometimes... It just shot it out of the freaking sky. You're kidding me. I I did not test this. Like I kind of make a made a catapult once. And you know, it it was shooting all right. And I didn't actually test it on the level. <laughs> like this is my first actual time testing it to see if it will destroy this thing. And it's looking like I may... This may not be the appropriate way of doing this. So we're gonna... Okay. Shit. Fuck. What is it? I'm trying to figure out what it's hitting. Okay, so that shoots it out of the sky. That was not something I had anticipated. For the record, though, I did make a catapult. So that's kind of cool. Actually, if I drive around to the side, is that going to work? I also... I got help from someone. My concept... My theory was right. My practice was wrong. So I'm going to bind the right wheels forward to 7 and reverse is 1 on the numpad. And my left wheels, forwards is 9, and reverse is 3. And what's that, what that's going to let me do is if I hold 7, let me get in there, if I hold 7, the right wheels go, and that's turning me left. If I hold 9, the left wheels go, and that makes me go right. And if I hold both, it makes me go forwards or backwards. So I now have a steering catapult. Oh crap. That's not good. Um, okay, bear with me. This isn't something I had planned for either. It looks like a stupid ladder. Alright, are we lined up? I think we're lined up. Launch it! Oh shit. Okay, 
this concept is not actually working very well. So what do we do about this? It might just be cannon time. Like, I think, I think cannons might actually be better for this. Yes. So let us build a barge. I think that's what we need. It's just a giant thing of death. And this might take me a couple minutes because I have something in my head now. And it's just going to be this giant cube. God, I'm going to need so much bracing on this thing. Yeah. Yeah. This is going to take so much bracing. I also made this giant block that just, like... It was, it was just wood and pistons. And as soon as I started... As soon as I, like, actually hit the play button, immediately just lag. I deemed it the D6 of lag, because it would go from 60 FPS, beautiful, to, like, A FPS. Like, you couldn't do anything. And this is kind of reminding me of that. Okay, this needs to come up a bit. Up. Uh, Shut up, intersections. You don't know me. X. Alright. Alright, we need so much bracing. See if we can get away with not doing it everywhere. Like, I don't want to sit here for 25 minutes just bracing this thing. Look at how braced it is, right? It's as sturdy as a dwarf. Beautiful. Oh, Jesus. Uh, yeah, there's too much here, and it's actually gonna just lag like hell. That concept is already out, because I can't, I can't reasonably let it lag like that. I'm trying to think of another cool concept. Maybe I could get away with flying into it. I haven't actually mastered flight, and I've only actually had maybe one or two attempts at flight. And I think all of those were on camera. I didn't even bother trying off camera. So let's see, how would flight work? I'm gonna need something up here. Alright. Because I need a lot of these. Do a three by three. So we'll have nine of these things. Is that is this stupid thing gonna work? Like I need it to be balanced at least. So that it doesn't just immediately topple. Alright, could this thing work? I'm not sure. How do you move it forward? Does it just let you move it forward? No, it does not. Oh! Oh! It's just kind of going. Oh, Jesus. Oh, God. Oh. Well. We, we had liftoff. We certainly had liftoff. Propeller. Yeah. 
Oh, I don't- I didn't look at the button for the propeller. Oh god. Why is it going the wrong way? We did a somersault. That wasn't- that wasn't too tragic. It actually did fairly well. So, does the propeller- was I- did I just have it on the wrong side? Go that way. <laughs> Jesus. We came close. Oh! Yes! Yeah! Suck it! Suck it, you stupid tower! You piece of shit! Yes! Alright. We flew into it! Use explosives to destroy 40%. Oh, we can do that. That's... That's easy. God. Watch, I'm gonna spend like 20 minutes here. I won't be able to figure it out. Something is gonna trick me. They were just gonna build like a little simple buggy. Like a little... Alright, just like four little wheels. There we go. What kind of explosives do we want to use? I think our only ones are cannons and bombs. It might even only be bombs. I have an idea. Alright, let me just bind these keys. So, left is 9 and 3. I actually have it on a little sticky note in front of me, so I can remember this. And if I if I mess up, I might accidentally hit my recording key. My recording key is on the numpad. So, it's crucial that I get that right. And then we're gonna have... Yeah, it doesn't look like there's anything to stop me from doing this. Get on the ground. Where is it? A grabber. <laughs> I believe this can grab bombs. I'm not sure if I can place it. Okay. Okay, so this is a little bit more difficult. What I have to do is I'm gonna have to replace this with a spinner. Yes. Uh huh. You might you might see where I'm going with this. I pray that you do. Wait, is it gonna I'm gonna have to extend it somehow. So I might need a piston. A piston. Attached to the grabber. Alright. Let's see how far that goes down. Okay. And then I need this. with a holder and a bomb. That's too high. I might only need the holder and the bomb. Okay, so we steer around. Oh no. Did I... Am I off? Yep, I am certainly off. Let's, let's get this thing. Come on, guy. Holder. Bomb. And we press H, don't... Oh, jeez. I believe it's Y. And I don't have to hold on to Y. And now we drive. Oh, no! Oh. Can we save this? Oh, jeez. We're playing with... We are playing with explosives here. I actually, I have something that I want to improve on this. I have something that I want to do to this. Okay, so I have to redo all of this because it isn't attached. But, 
I'm gonna have these pistons all bound to H, and then this other piston bound to something else. So I can make it go really high up. And it's gonna be super cool, and it's gonna look so badass, and you're gonna say, wow, you're really cool. You build some nice stuff. And I'll say, yeah, yeah, I do. Thank you. Wait, I need... That needs to be a piston right there. Boom. Uh, I was so busy complimenting myself that I kind of forgot what I was doing. And then you are going to be bound to, let's just say, P. Why not? Are these attached? Okay, so those are attached. That's kind of heavy. I think I need to brace it a bit. Actually, I don't know if bracing works well with pistons. We're about to find out, because it's going to lift up and then probably rip this thing apart. So if I hit H... Yeah, no, pistons don't work with... What was I thinking? Doo -doo -doo -doo. Can I grab it? No, I have to actually... Oh, wrong one! Shit! <laughs> Shit. <laughs> I forgot. This one was P, not not H. Y. Yes. Fuck it, I don't need the holder. Come on, let's do this. Oh no, I have... I did it again. I'm gonna turn right. Oh, bear with me. Spring! Okay. Bomb delivery service, motherfucker. How do I drop it? Yeah! Yes! It worked. Awesome. Alright, let's see what this next one wants out of me. Destroy 90% of everything. Knights, tents, and cannon. Cannons? Huh. I don't think I'm going to have time to drop the bomb on them. Cannons. Ah, that sounds... that sounds rough. But cannons can't point up. I think I need to fly. Actually. Alright, I need to check. Oh, V to drop object. Okay, I thought it was saying Y to grab objects. It's saying V to drop objects. I'm a moron sometimes. Still, so cool. Alright, so we just want like... Yeah. That'll totally balance us, right? It's not gonna balance us at all. Now it doesn't have a choice. Okay. I want... No, this isn't what I want. I'm curious, is there a way to throw a flamethrower at them? But why would I do that if I could just throw a flaming ball at them? Right? Hmm. Or maybe... Maybe we can make... A uh, spinning windmill of death. That sounds kind of cool. Now let's see if I can actually do it. Yeah, let's move this down. I'm going to need some height. Yes. Height. We also want counterbalance weight. Maybe some protection for our innards. No. Get in there. Alright. So what this is gonna be is gonna be this rolling thing. And I'll bind the wheels later. How long are the blades? Those are pretty long. So if I get, like, a spinning block, 
and put a blade on it. That's not exactly what I had in mind. There we go. That is exactly what I had in mind. And it is a little bit finicky to get things on the bottom. But there we go. This is my concept. Check this out because there's going to be cannons firing at me. I'm actually going to have to do the back too so that the weight is semi normal. I think I want it like that. Yeah. Oh, yeah, this is looking good. Ho oh, ho ho. Man, they aren't gonna stand a chance. They are gonna weep. I don't think that's symmetrical, so sorry. I know some people are really gonna hate that. Okay, so right is seven and one. Seven and one. And left. It's 9 and 3. Okay. Alright. Oh, it works! Yes! Oh, shit! No, we're still going. Fuck. Well, we have a giant battering ram now. Let's do this. Oh, my wheels. Oh, my wheels aren't... Oh, they, they flipped me. They flipped me. My, my blade is still going, though. Yes, take him out. Take him out. Huh, okay, so that didn't entirely work. It looked like I had some bracing issues, to be quite honest. Which is not that surprising. So let's, let's brace a couple of things. And let's, like... Let's get a small brace right there, a small brace right there. Yes! Oh shit, those cannons! Ah! Uh, I will get you! Oh shit, uh, back. Go back. Fuck. Yeah! I'm still- I can do this. I've still got wheels. I can still kind of drive. I've got like a blade. Come on. Come on, buddy. Get the- get the fucking- yes. Yeah. See your camp? Do you see it? Come on, drive over it. Drive over it, yeah! sufficiently destroyed. I think that's gonna be it. Let's see what the next one is, just so you can get hyped for the next one. What the fuck? Destroy 80% of the monument. It's gonna do something crazy. I know it. Like, I know it. It's gonna, like, shoot music at me or something. Anyways, thanks for watching.